Hey guys, I'm pulling up to the shop now. I'm linking up with Afonz. We got a bunch of stuff that we're working on. Really cool project. I'm pulling up to the shop and I just want to show you guys a quick update of what I've been using, what have been my go-to tools lately. Kind of my setup. So I'm going to take you guys to the shop, update you guys on that. Hi guys, so I'm not gonna show you guys, you know, the alcohol, sanic strips, all that stuff. Make sure you're sanitary, disclaimer. That's very important. Make sure you have all the products that you need to maintain your clippers, to be sanitary, take care of your clients. But I'm gonna show you guys just a quick overview of the tools that I use the most. Cause I know a lot of you guys have been wondering what guards I use, that type of thing. So let's go through it real quick. All right, so shears, I've been using fresh shears lately. I've had these for a while. We were gonna actually partner up, collaborate on some shears, 245 and fresh shears. Pandemic hit and we just weren't connecting like we were previous to that. So it just never happened. Who knows, it might happen in the future, but I've been using fresh shears. I've been using Sam Via blending shears. These shears right here are fire for blending and, and for knocking out bulk, but they're not texturizing shears. These are blending shears. Difference is this takes out line. It doesn't take out texture. And if you cut enough, you will take length off. Okay, hopefully that makes sense. My guards, green half guard from wall, black number one guard from wall, but this is an old guard. This, this is a classic guard. I don't even remember how I got this. I think I got it from like a local barber supply. This number one guard, I feel like it's very popular overseas, but um, I personally don't remember where I got it. I think you can get it on eBay though. If I could find an Amazon link, I'll put it in the description below, along with all these, these other products. I use the one and a half Babelish guard. You can buy this separately for like $1.50 or something like that. I just like the way that this cuts in comparison to the wall one. I feel like the wall teeth are too wide. This is a smoother cut. Personally, that's what I think and how I feel. It does feel like it cuts a different length, but it still works in my opinion. If you notice, it says 4.8 millimeters where the wall will say 4.5 millimeters. I use number two, number three, number four wall guards, the color coded guards. The razor that I use, the brand that I like the most is Astra or Dorco Prime. Of course, I use the 245 triple cartridge razor. The reason why this is called triple cartridge razor is because when you open the slide, you have certain amount of exposure. You're gonna put the blade in these grooves. These grooves, you can kind of get to stick out more or you can push them in more, but you want them to stick out enough to where you can sit the blade easily into those grooves. Once you slide it in, notice how much is exposed. The blade is sticking out. This blade comes with three different cartridges and each cartridge has a different exposure. One has little to no exposure and another one has even more exposure than this. And when I mean exposure, I mean how much this blade sticks out of the green razor holder. I hope that makes sense. You can tighten and loosen this depending on how tight you want it. All right, so let's move on now. All right, so compressor is made by 245. This is the best compressor on the market. I've been using this airbrush in the meantime. I need to get a replacement for it, but this is the best compressor on the market. Nothing has as much power. It only runs when you pull the trigger, so the battery life on it is insane. This is an amazing tool. I'm using 245 No Drip. This is the color that I use. You shake it really, really well. You pour it into the reservoir and you're ready to enhance. Combs, brushes. This is by far my favorite brush on the market. This is the Denman Fade Brush, okay, by Jacking Denman Fade Brush. I buy this from, I think, Cosmoprof. Either Cosmoprof or Salon Centric. Super, super soft, has some give to it. Amazing for fading. I use the Denman Flexi Styling Brush for blow drying and styling. An amazing tool, does everything. This is the only tool that I use for styling. I got this from Barber Josh OP. He put me onto this brush. This to me is the best comb for clipper over comb. Usumi, made in Japan, amazing quality. This comb is the best one that I've found for clipper over comb, in my opinion. Really great tension, really high quality, awesome clipper comb. To me, by far the best cutting comb is by YS Park. I'll put a link in the description. This is the one that I like. I just like this to not have its, the teeth as spread out. This to be finer so that you can grab hair, have more tension. And I just think it's an amazing comb for scissor work. All the brushes and combs that I, I use the most, okay? So let's go with clippers now. Everybody got a pair of workhorses. These are amazing. They never let you down. Wall actually sent me these with my name engraved. 
Obviously, I got the 245 power clip for wireless charging. And these are just amazing workhorses. I want to swap the blade out, though. I typically don't use a fade blade. I typically like the regular taper blade. But nonetheless, these are amazing clippers. Got to have a pair of these. Lately, I've been using the Wall Finale Shaver. And not because I think it's the best shaver, but more so because my Fabulous shaver is dead right now. So I've been too lazy to put it on the charger. And I don't know where the heck my power clip went for it. So I've been using the Finale Shaver. It's a good shaver, though. It's a really good shaver. But you gotta have a shaver in general. You gotta have a shaver. These have been my go-tos, my hitters. I have some amazing looking trimmers. Let me show you. These things to me are gorgeous, but I haven't been using them. I think I've only used them once. The reason why I haven't been using them is because with trimmers, bro, once you get a trimmer to set, to hit the way you want it to, you don't want to mess with anything else. So even though these look great right next to my clippers, I got these things hitting so good. They're taking a beating. I've been using these, but they're hitting so good, man. I don't even want to touch nothing. Once these stop hitting like I want them to, I'll go to these and I'll take my time to set them up. These have been my go-to clippers for fading and doing most of my cutting. I just love these clippers. For a lot of people, they feel like they're too big or, or whatnot, but I think they're amazing. I love the way that they cut and I've gotten so used to them that these have been my go-to. Obviously, we got the power clip on them from 245. And then let's look at my products. I use a lot of pure powder. You get 245.com. The hairspray I like is from Big Sexy Hair. Love this hairspray. And I always buy the, the small ones. They don't take up a lot of space and I don't use a lot of it so my water bottle my water spray bottle you gotta have one of these obviously cool care and then this is the shave gel that i use believe it or not i use 245 shave gel i cannot live without this this is my compressor it blows air keeps my customers nice and clean throughout the cut when i don't have this it feels weird i don't like using the blow dryer it doesn't have enough pressure you gotta be careful with it though because it could hurt your clients don't spray them in the ear that type of thing but once you get used to them you're not gonna be able to cut without them so obviously you need clipper oil and all that good stuff but like i said i'm not gonna cover that today i'm gonna try these out today see how these are working these finales are probably gonna go away for now and we're gonna try these out all right guys so this is the new prodigy the new prodigy shaker so, you guys already know. We've done boxes before. The shavers feel good. I can see it's charging. Oops. Fine. You want me to shave you? Oh, no. Oh, they look good, though. No, 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 no. I'm excited to use them. We on our way to my, where I grew up. When I moved from New York to Florida. It's about a half hour from here. With you driving, we might get there in two. No, I don't drive like that. You know that. When's the last time you've been there? years actually i stopped by one time that i was in the area just to see what my house looks okay. like now it's a rough area bro i want to stay on topic with the tools and stuff i want you guys to know i use other tools as well i use other products i use other clippers i don't know about you fonts but every now and then like i just switch it up just because i've been getting bored of using the same clipper every single day it's so funny i literally because i'm budgeting right now right because sometimes clippers do get expensive my new clippers do get expensive cappuccino cappuccino cap oh, capping capillitis capillitis yep all right no but seriously i got on my budget and just to keep it interesting again or just to switch it up i actually brought back my outliners my corded outliners because nah, I didn't I, have no, I didn't have no hitters. I'm not going that far. You ain't going I, that far. Hell no. My skeletons too. Yeah, I do the skeletons. Like, they, like, like they were. Oh, they're skeletoned out. Yeah. Oh damn, those are old. What's your go-to's right now? What tools are you using? Okay, I'm gonna go through the list. Go ahead. You gotta get through it quickly. All right, go. Okay. Go-to clipper. FX's. Go-to trimmer. Skeletons. Razor handle. The 245 with the triple cartridge. Are you using those? Thank you. Bro. The red ones. The red ones. Yeah. Thank you, bro. That yeah. means a lot. They actually, bro. bro as far as like i want to know where things are and the fact that it's red yeah. like i know where it is just like i a, love a that color system yo a color system no cap bro you know i've been heavy on color systems for the longest bro being able to subconsciously bro like just see where your stuff is and you don't want to think for. about it like yeah. it's just there all right what razor are you putting in razor handle Brand. so i took i switch it up from time to time i'll go through a season where it's nothing but asterisk and then just to switch it up i'll go to a primes same here Dorco Primes and Astros. Yeah. That's I switch it up. Right now yeah. I've been I've been using Astros straight up, but every now and then I go I just switch it up and go. Eh, I'm, I'm light-handed, so I don't need to do much. Go about capillitis. Yeah, cap what? No, capillitis again? You're light-handed? Hell yeah! What? I don't know. I don't Are you know. basing it off how I quickly edged you up yesterday? That don't I count. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just saying. You're in the middle. I'm mm -hmm. in the middle. Yeah, he lined me up yesterday, guys. Yeah, but that was literally El Zikio. El Zikio. I'm leaning this way. Now it's fine. Right? Yeah, right, bro. <laughs> I'm playing, bro. I uh, I would say that's my go-to right now. I do have the seniors, and that's about it. Get my hands on. I, I'm not done with my questions though. Oh, don't, go ahead. Don't. Go ahead. Uh, what shears are you using? Right now, I got the 245. Are you using blending shears too? I do, but they're they're like cheap. 
the the guards. What guards are you using? The colored wall guards. Well, so you're not using any Beyblitz guards? You're using no. all wall? All wall. What kind of hairspray do you like? I like a stronghold. Is there a certain brand that you go with? Uh, no. Yeah, I've been going just no because loyalty. of supply. I mean, no loyalty? I'm still. I mean, what do you use? I'm kidding, I'm kidding. What bro. do you use? I use big sexy hair. Big sexy hair? Alcohol. Are you using aftershave? What kind of, what are you doing Yeah, the barber one. The barber one? What does it smell like? I don't even know how to explain scents. Do you put tonic in your water? I forgot to tell you guys, I put fresh, like a cucumber tonic in my water when I spray it in the hair. It's dope. But you're basing it off just smell or also it helps you grab the hair better? It's supposed to be good for the scalp. Yeah. But for me, mostly it's, it's to keep the water smelling fresh. Because you know how sometimes, sometimes it does that water been in that bottle for too long and it right. starts to stink? What shape are you using? I use the Babless Pro. Yeah, Pro babe, to me that's the best shape. Are we going to try the new Gamma ones, the Stylecraft ones? With the Gammas, I just got my hands on that single foil. That's convenient. I, I like them. When I held them, I was like, nah, this ain't gonna do nothing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. At first glance, it's like, no. You're not trying to like do a large amount of work on that. That's like detail, like that's around here. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Even even like the clients that have that super coarse hair. Love it. Bro. I love the mustache. Love it. Woo. Um, Babyless came out with that first. Actually, Wall came out Wall, with it. Wall, remember when we went to London? Yeah, it's very popular in Russia too. Yeah. That Wall single foil. So they came out with it first. Yeah. Then Babyless came out with a really nice one, but it was a baddie operated one. And then, you know, Stylecraft and Gamma. I always get confused. I never know what to call them. But they came out with one that's lithium ion powered. It's really dope. It's convenient, like you said. Combs, are you still using the ones you stole from me? <laughs> no. <laughs> what happened to those? I gave it to Dre and we never saw it. <laughs> but I'm using one. Why you only have one comb, bro? Okay, so I have the YS Park. One of those and everything else, is they're too much, they're like bigger. So my go-to is just one. Like, you think I should have what, like three? You should have a bunch. When I go to shows, I buy like five. I gotta step my game up with combs, shears. Combs and shears are the main two, for sure. Yeah. Combs and shears. I wanna get like some Hikaris or some Mr. Tiny. Those things get Mostly Hikaris. Expensive. Yeah. But the Hikari shears, when I went to the Fidel Sassoon Academy in California, yeah. that's what they use is Hikari, and they had these shears there, bro. Amazing, amazing shears. I think that's it, right? Is there anything you wanna tell my subscribers that don't know who you are? For those that don't know who I am, I'm Yo Fonz. I've been in the barber game now almost five years. I started under Basio. I've been friends for a long time, over a decade. I used to help him with his videos, camera guy, editor. I wasn't talking about that. I was talking about like tools and stuff. Tools? Oh, like, bro, like you said, for those that don't know you. I was just, I'm messing with you, bro. Dude, you are messing with me way too much today. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so anyways, guys, at the end of the day, man, the tools, it's really right. a preference. Or, you gotta try all of them, right? You gotta try them out. And like you said in the beginning, like you should have a variety, enough to keep it fun. Yeah, you know I think what I'm so. saying? Because it does get dry when you're using the same tools. And, and buy as many 245 parts as you can. The batteries are amazing. If you got uh, wall clippers, uh, we come out the babeless ones, whatever. So you can buy as many. Just buy them all. It's, it's gonna make it fun. It's, it's yeah. gonna make it fun. Like, <laughs> <laughs> all right, but seriously, man, that's the setup. I didn't want to drag this on too much, but Fonz was with me. We were working on a project. Yeah. I felt like it'd be cool to get two different perspectives. Fonz has been doing this for a while. That's my setup right now. That's what I. That's blow dryer. What blow dryer are you using? I'm using the uh, Dyson. Dyson. Thank you. Hey, you got a Dyson. No, Drake. Does, does it happen to have 245 logos yeah, all yeah. over it? No, 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 not all over it. You talking about the black one? Yeah. No, 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 no. Y'all got, y'all got Dre this one. And he just put the sticker on. Okay, there's still a reward out for my damn blow dryer that's gone. That somebody took from the show? Yeah. Still, okay. a, it, I wasn't the, there, so don't blame it on. All right, the reward I was hundred dollars. I'm gonna bump it up to three hundred dollars for anyone who knows the whereabouts of my Dyson Sorry. blow dryer, hand painted 245 are all over it. I know I there's a lot of people that don't believe in snitching, but in this case, go all in. Yeah. Let us know who he is. But lately I've been using Gamma blow dryer that Austin was kind enough to send me. It's been a great blow dryer. And then dragged out hair products. As much 245 hair products as possible. Uh -huh. I use everything, bro. I try everything. And the reason why I try everything is because it can help me improve my products. Uh -huh. Sea salt spray. Sea salt spray. Uh, I like sea salt spray. Yeah. Obviously the 245 pure powder. We have the best clay in the world, but they're not I'm in stock bro, right Bro, insane. I was just talking to a client yesterday. He was like, yo, can I get more clay? I'm like, they're out of stock. I'm over here trying to look for a different clay. Nothing no. comes close. No, no, like We're ho hoping to bring it back in 2021, so look out for that. Yo, guys, we love y'all. Go subscribe to Yo Fonz, his YouTube channel. I'll put a link in the description. And I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Don't forget, yeah, we drop every single day. We're dropping something. We do this for the culture. We do this Insane. because we love the industry. We love barbering. I love you guys, man. So let me know in the comments what you thought. If you wanted to add any you know, tools or discuss any of the tools that we discussed today, please do in the comments below. Smash
smash the like button. I'll see you guys tomorrow with that next video. Cause we got daily.